Certainly one of the biggest stories in baseball over the past couple weeks involves Washington Nationals closer Jonathan Papelbon, the former Red Sox closer, charged into the dugout, had a big altercation with National star Bryce Harper, in which Papelbon grabbed Harper by the neck. You've probably seen the photos. Now the question is, will Papelbon eventually sign those photos? If he does, what are they worth? We went to Sports World and Peabody to find out. We're with Phil Castanetti at Sports World and Peabody, and this is a very famous photo of Phil. Larry Bird, Julius Irving, uh, the famous choke hold that Larry Bird had on Julius Irving. You maintain that Larry's never signed this photo. I have never seen a photo signed by either one of these two players. It's legit. And I saw online a sign, but that's, you don't buy it. You know what? You can see lots of things online that you got to be wary of, and that's one of them. Now, if Larry Bird signed one of these photos, what would it be worth? It would pre probably be worth thousands of dollars because he just refuses to sign it. Now, this is one here that I happen to know about. Uh, this is a scoop I had back in 2004. This is the famous Jason Veritek, uh, A-Rod smooshing of the mitt in the face, uh, Saturday afternoon at Fenway. I asked Veritek about this during the 2004 World Series, a piece I wrote in the Herald. He told me he walked into Fenway the next day, he signed one of these, and that his daughter made a reference, his little girl made a reference to the photo where he's beating up that man. Tech felt bad about it, and my understanding is he's not signed one of these since. I've heard the same thing, that uh, the same exact story. Signed one. The old Fenway Park when you had to slide it under the fence to get to the players, and yeah. he signed one, heard the same story. His daughter said, Dad, what's that all about? And never signed another one as, I guess, A-Rod has signed a couple, but Veritek, no, for sure, no. And if I could get A-Rod and Jason Veritek to sign this photo, what would that be worth? Thousands of dollars again? You can retire from the Herald. <laughs> all right, so let's get down to brass tacks here. Uh, if Jonathan Papelbon and Bryce Harper would have signed a photo, on it, or, or say a cover of the New York Post, Chokers, uh, I doubt that both of them would sign up. What's that worth? Is that up there, too? Yeah, anything like that would be up there because I'm sure they're not going to want to sign it. So, you know, these things, they might sign a couple at the beginning, then think better of it and stop signing. So it'd be very unique and worth, you know, worth a lot of money. All right. So if I could give you one photo, a signed A-Rod and Veritek, a signed Julia Serving and Larry Bird, or a signed Bryce Harper and Jonathan Papelbon, which of the three would you want? Prioritize. Which, which order would you like to have those in? I would like the Bird Irving first. Um, you're a Celtics fan. It's, I am, yeah. and it's the oldest. Um, the second would be, you know, the Veritek A-Rod because, you know, Veritek refuses. And then third would be the Papelbon and, and Hopper because who knows what they're going to do with it. All right. Phil Castanetti, Sports World in Peabody. By the way, just got a Luke Garrick rookie card in. Check it out. <laughs>